My name is Klaus Bunder. I'm the uh, director of the Danish Cyclist Federation. Right now I'm standing in front of the bicycle snake, we call it, uh, which is the newest piece of bicycle infrastructure in the city of Copenhagen. This bicycle here is uh, not my own bicycle. This is one of the new share bikes in Copenhagen, Go Bike. And it's uh, really a state-of-the-art uh, bike share system. It's uh, an electric bike. Some cyclists will say it's a bit of cheating riding on an uh, e-bike. You don't get as much exercise as you do on, on an ordinary bicycle. But on the other hand, it's really nice if you have a strong wind coming in front of you or if the hills go up or you just need to go a little longer distances. I think it's, it's an excellent support to, to have. If you don't, as a tourist here, jump up on a bike, you are cheating yourself of a very, very good experience because uh, it is the way to see Copenhagen is on a bicycle because there you blend with all the Copenhageners who cycle. You can see the Copenhageners picnic, having a good time, playing with their kids, uh, playing soccer or, or whatever. It's, it's, a, it's a great way to see our city. I will lift my finger and say, please look up when you cycle. Don't stay focused down here, but look up because there's a lot of cyclists in Copenhagen. Actually, almost 50% of all study places and workplaces in the city of Copenhagen are reached by bicycle every single day on a cold, windy autumn day like today. And even on a uh, snowy day, you will see people cycling. And of course, you will see a lot of people cycling during the beautiful spring and summer in our country.